welcome back now we are going to see on premises vm on premises instance need to migrate to in our cloud as a image that image later on i have to use some database testing is going on okay which database is some couple of uh, some databases are there in that particular vm that we need to migrate into the google cloud okay for that you need to take with uh, you if you have you can able to convert into vhd files if you have access for that suppose if you people are uh, junior means you don't have access means you cannot able to do i did that i did and i exported see here in this folder we have a file it contains what is the size of this one go here approximately 4 gb only some minimal databases are there to test the environment in google cloud for that reason we, we extracted with a vhd file this has to be uploaded to your google cloud before going to do that okay before build the image we have to upload these files these files to the cloud what is the such how you can able to do that S simply i'm saying later i will tell you some we have buckets okay means it is like a google drive simple words you have to create it we have to create it okay see whatever the things are there bucket name what is this imya dev okay uh, some we have some codes also there in imya we have like e uh, u like this we have uh, sv we have means sweden related like this we need to have some different types of buckets are there according to the bucket we have to upload suppose imia means what we are supporting imia europe middle east africa lot of countries are there some based on the countries we have to create the buckets accordingly we will go with that okay this this development is going on some london region okay create like this london some will be like i'm giving like this label if you want to create this is optional you want lower case okay fine london okay bucket name this one is bucket name you want to add the label label means what is this key you can write a london this is value mm, must be key value okay it's not required as a for understanding continue which region multi region you want to go with the charges will be more okay i don't want to go with dual region means two across the regions which region you need europe okay finland according to you can do that later i will tell you in buckets whatever the things no i am not going with this go to this uk region okay fine continue uh, these are so many things are there later i will tell you in storage class continue create uh, enforce public access as of now i am giving public because we need to upload right in real time there will be a vpn all those things are there okay i have a bucket okay this is development mission right create one more folder for this one create a folder okay dev some db test right they are saying db deploy number will be there version numbers or uh, we have a tickets actually change tickets according to that it will be there this is the change request which machine is that like that it will be there create okay fine this is the folder okay you got the thing storage now come back to images compute engine 
go to images first you need to know with jbase then you can go with gcloud commands that is important in another video i'll show you all those things in command line as well say create image image name is what is the image name uh, imia imia some db some l1 okay 0 1 server server names these are all not disk previous in in description you can see that disk level how to do that okay here i am going with virtual disk this is in my on premises okay for this to import we need some permissions okay you need some permissions you need to do that right grant it will take one minute mm import permission must be create okay let me refresh yeah got it fine family you want to write a family whatever family you can do uh, then detailed information the sent os okay seven this is uh, dev server some databases are there databases mm. test is going on okay test is going on dev test some futures are there future test is going on write it change request also you can write not required okay now these are the things go here right where browse go to this london okay no here see here it is not showing because it, you have to upload that that we didn't upload it go open console okay go to the bucket bucket you have created right okay in our local means in, in your on premises we have see here upload the files deploy select all upload it is uploading okay see it is uploading it will take some time okay now it is uploaded almost uh, 45 minutes if you see this one okay it is uploaded now we need to build a image first okay customized image for our database team or some some testing team or dev team something like that. create a image image name you can give uh, imia for example database right databases some migration some migration is going on uh, first they need to test it right migration on premises right they need to okay image based on that only they need to verify select here okay go here disk already we uploaded in this london go here yeah this one this file we need to select select it family you want to write whatever you want to write uh, this is a centos image centos 7 okay this belongs to CentOS, right? This belongs to Imia database uh, migration upgrade to cloud, like that. Based on your change request ticket number, something create. Now you are creating an image, okay? According to that image 
then you can use that image for your VMs, for your applications. Create this. It will take some time, approximately 10 minutes to 15 minutes. Okay. Here, uh, previously, I did that. Okay. Some... some for some testing now this one is going on okay this one is going on it may take some time approximately 10 minutes 7 to 10 minutes okay you can open and you can click on this and you can verify see what is happening see let me what is happening pulling that verifying checking everything it will be build is going on okay internally from where this is the source internally okay there is a build build is going build process Later, I will tell you GCP DevOps in that uh, video, so you can go through that. Okay, as of now, just keep in mind, it is taking time. Still, it is going on almost uh, 5 minutes. Okay, you can refresh 6 minutes. Now, build import successful means it converted as a image say this one okay image name is this one now you can build a vm using this image go here instance Okay, instance name, EMEA, mission name, okay, DB, there is going some test, right, they are doing some migration, dev, 0, 1 or something, 9 or something, it will be there, which region, you are belongs to, this region, select it, okay, whatever you want, there is some criteria, accordingly, you have to do that. 4 GB is not sufficient because I know that it, uh, it is a some approximately Q32 GB. Okay. And uh, change this one. Go to this. Go to the custom image. Image name. Which one is migration, right? This one. 35 GB. I am not sure. Mm, keep this. So let me try with 50 GB okay instance name device name use what is this EMEA EMEA device name is important for your inventory based on that devices they will be noting down this is the device name device number will be there okay this is a device virtual only but you have a device some 99 code number will be there in em009 something okay this is the device according to the devices only they will be having some inventory just select it now find 32 gb 200 monthly billing nothing to worry no problem we are going to delete just create it i am creating an instance instance is nothing but a virtual machine for our database testing to the development team they need some testing in the cloud right for that we need to provide some vms we have cloud run and all those things but older days what we are doing that we need to know
say it is completed done right just log into the machine it's failed let me retry maybe quota problems may be no you cannot because unexpected error wait for few minutes okay we'll wait for some time okay i hope it will connect we need to wait for some time it will connect okay in coming video i'll show you what is meant by templates we have seen what is meant by solo tenant nodes this thing we need to know theoretically only because this is something like i'll tell you coming video i'll tell you Please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget. Thank you. Please subscribe to my daddy's channel for regular updates. Click on bell icon.